Hey everyone, Netlify now supports teams, so I'm here to show you how you can create your own team. When you're in Netlify, uh, you may notice that now you can see your username here on the top, uh, level navigation. So if you click there, you're going to see a button that says create a new team. You want to click that. So the first thing you want to do is uh, give your team a name. So imagine that I work for the uh, Delos company. So just type Delos and then we are going to pick a plan. Now, um, if you are not familiar with uh, our new pricing and all of what we offer in our new plans, you can click here in this link down below um, to learn more. If you want to go with a bronze plan, that's the free plan. You just need to pick that one and just hit the button create team. And that's all there is to it. Um, couldn't be simpler. Now, if you want to take advantage of features like, for example, administration roles and password access control, um, stuff like that, you can pick a paid plan. And if you do that, um, we're just going to ask you uh, how many people are on your team, uh, if you prefer to be billed monthly or yearly, right here. Um, you can select uh, which uh, payment option do you want to use, uh, if you have one in your account. If you don't, you can just click add payment method, add your card details, um, and you're going to be done with that. Uh, lastly, just check if everything is all right here in the summary. If you have a coupon code, uh, you can add it right here. And once you're ready, click create team. And, um, and that's it. We have created a team on Edlify now. You can switch here in the navigation bar. You can click that to switch contacts. So between your own sites or your uh, team sites. And uh, from here, from the screen, you can just add a new site from all of the Git providers, so GitHub, GitLab, uh, Bitbucket. Uh, you can drag and drop a folder, or if you want, you can transfer a site that you already owned on Edlify. So for example, I'm gonna pick this one and make sure you're in settings and you scroll all the way to the bottom and on site info you can check this drop down here it says owner so from here you can change you can transfer the site from your personal account or from your other team to any team that you have and uh that's it once you hit that i'm going to transfer to the dallas team i click there uh one last confirmation that make sure that you really want to do it and once you click transfer it's going to transfer your site. Now, if I scroll all the way to the top, I can see that my old DVD screensaver, which is the best website ever, is now on the Delos team. And that's it. Thanks for watching.